so hello everyone how is your day going in this video i'm going to show you how you can customize your uh, code blocks the org mode code blocks in emacs so for example here you can see the background color is black which is looking really nice right so how to do this you may be wondering so it's really easy guys just hit meta x and uh, type customize face hit enter and uh, here you can see a lot of options so for example here we have outline one two three right these represents the level one level two headings the color of these headings right so there are a lot of options which you can customize and i will highly suggest you to do customization but right now we have to customize code blocks right so just search blocks and we have nothing called blocks so do a backspace we, we have five options here but we just need three options which is org block org block end line and org block begin line okay so choose org block and hit enter here you can see you will have a lot of options click on show all attributes and you can see there are really a lot of options which i can customize so right now i just want a background color so let's check the background color option and you can type whatever color you want so let's say black okay here you can see the preview of the color okay it is in black color that's why we are unable to see you can choose whatever color okay just click on choose and you will have the options of choosing whatever color you want you can just scroll down and choose whatever color you want so yeah that's how easy it is but there may be some times where you want some specific colors for example light green okay we already have light green here uh, let's try something more specific light red okay so as you can see this color is not getting recognized that's why we are unable to see the sample color right so there may be situations like this so in this situation we can use hex values so let's just google uh, by the way if you want my configuration my emacs config you, you can just check out my github link is in the description and a lot of people ask me what theme i am using so i am using a theme called red dark which was created by me so if you want you can just check out and uh, creating themes in emacs it's really easy guys okay i will make a separate video on that but but right now if you want my configuration you can just check out my github links are in the description but right now let's search hex color picker and you can choose whatever color you want okay so for example this color okay and you can just copy the hex value and paste it there and by that way you can add any colors you want okay you can configure other stuffs like fonts uh, slant basically this will uh, make it italic oblique and there are a lot of options just you try out but for now this is enough so i will click apply but if you want this settings to be permanent just click on apply and save but right now i don't want it to be permanent so i will click on apply and uh, let's see what has happened as you can see it's not looking nice and by the way you might be thinking why the first line and the last line has no change in color it's because the org block option will only uh, customize the inner block okay so for the first line and the last line we already had uh, let us see yeah here we have begin line and end line right here we have so you can just click on that and you can add a background color right and you can also add foreground color foreground color is uh, this color th this text color okay so you can do a lot of things guys okay after doing everything if you want these changes to be permanent don't forget to hit apply and save okay so let me click apply and save here and also i had another option right uh, org block here also i will do apply and save and also we have to configure the end line so let me just uh, customize face end line and uh, here also i will do the same thing and apply and save okay so everything is saved and as you can see wrote in it dot el okay so basically all these settings which we did right now is saved in in it dot el file so let me just open it uh yeah here it is in it dot el 
so as you can see here are the settings line number 17 to 24 this whole thing was the changes which we did right now so if you don't have any problem with this code being here then yeah no problem the video is over guys have a great day uh, see you next time don't forget to subscribe but if you are like me and uh, you always uh, write your configuration in a org file like this okay then of course you can just copy that code and uh, paste it here by the way i'm not going to use this pink background color okay so no worries and that's all this video is over guys uh this was the first video which i made in english okay because uh, i am not a english native speaker my dear friends so uh, how was my english please let me know and uh, right now my english is very very weak so somehow i tried making this video but with practice i think i will improve so no issues if you have any doubts if you want more videos related to emacs linux window managers or anything okay just comment it down and i will try to make those videos in english okay um yeah have a great day guys bye good night